Hi everyone. Oops. Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a great weekend because we went to Indianapolis and stuff like that. It's really, really cool. And by the way, guys, I have um, a new phone. I'm going to show you guys. So let me get started. So this is my dad's mom's phone. It's beautiful. And I added the wallpaper of the city. It's actually my dad's mom's phone. It's actually not my phone. It... <coughs> my mom... My dad's mom got a new phone. I don't know why, but yeah. And Mark just gave it to me. It's a good phone. It's a Samsung phone. If you don't play me, let me see if I can see it. Alright. Says Samsung phone. Yeah. So yeah. So my school's been doing great so far. There's been I think I can show you guys in a second because it's really heartbreaking because you know that students got COVID again at school. It happened last year also when I was in the first grade. I mean, the first day of ninth grade. That's when it happened. But it happened again. So. Just give me a second and I'll show you in a second. Alright, so I found it. Let me see if I can make it bigger. works. Let me see if I can make it up in full screen. Alright. I don't think I can. Okay, there it is. So. Oops. Alright. Can I see? Let me make it up. Alright. I think I'll shoot this side, right, so. There it is. If you guys can't see it, that's fine, but this is the COVID-19 stuff of the students and teachers that got COVID. So, there's a one from Brookside Elementary School. There's been five students that got COVID. <coughs> and there's one teacher that got COVID. There's 19 of them are quarantined. And at East Jasmine High School, there's nine students that got COVID. And there's one teacher that got COVID. And there's... Oh, never mind. I'm on the one one. There's no teachers that got COVID. Never mind. At East. But there's... Four students, I mean, four people are quarantined. At East Jesuit Middle School, there's five students that got COVID. Two teachers got COVID. 30 of them are quarantined. And Jasmine early already Barrage, there's four students that got COVID. There's one teacher that got COVID. 23 of them are quarantined. And Nicholas Elementary School, that's... But I went to that school when I was little, Nicholas Bell Elementary School. I think I was there since second grade because when I was in first grade, I was in Rosemont John Brown Elementary School when I was in first grade and stuff like that. And when I was in second, third grade, and fourth grade, and fifth grade, I went to element Nicholas Bell Elementary School. But yeah, there's been one student that got COVID. There's no teachers that, no teachers got, no, sorry, I'm not talking. And there's five people that are quarantined in Red Oak Elementary School. I don't know how I say it, but yeah. There's three kids that got COVID, no teachers that got COVID, six of them are quarantined. And Rosenmar Tomber Elementary, I don't know what it says, but there's one student that got COVID, there's two teachers that got COVID, 14 of them are quarantined. And 
well as Omar Dombar Elementary School, two kids that got COVID. No teachers that got COVID, nine of them are quarantined. And Wilmore Elementary School, there's six kids that got COVID, two teachers that got COVID, and seven of them are quarantined. And West Chestnut High School, that's the school I went, and there's lots more. There's 29 kids, that's the school I go to. West Chestnut High School, I was there last year, and I'm here again. I'm a sophomore, if you guys don't know, but yeah. There's 29 students that got COVID. That's a lot because, you know, 29 kids is a lot. If you guys don't believe me, I'll probably show you. I don't know if you guys can see it. Do you guys see... Oops, let me... Do you guys see West Chesman High School? I know it, it's... I know the thing... The phone looks here, but can you guys see it? I think I have it on upside down. Let me see how I can fix that. No, I think it's white. All right. But there's 29 kids at West Chestman High School that got COVID. And that's the school I go to. Because there's lots of students that take off their mask. And they don't listen at all. And there's one teacher that got COVID. And there's four of them are quarantined. And West Chestman Middle School. That's the school. That's the school I went there. That's West Chestman Middle School. That's the school I went to last year. Or two years, whatever. There's been nine students that got COVID, one teacher got COVID, 14 of them. Sorry, seven of them are quarantined. Wilmore Elementary School, two kids that got COVID, two teachers got COVID, 14 of them are quarantined. Um, virtual Learning Academy, none so far. Um, I think it says T A A N S P O R T A T I O N apartment. I don't know how I really say it, but I'm just gonna say that. There's three of them. Three teachers that, I mean, the adult. I think it's adults, like teachers, whatever. Three of them have COVID. No quarantine contacts. So yeah. And yeah. So, the total of students that got COVID is 81. The total of teachers is 16 teachers that got COVID. And the totals of quarantine contacts are 154. So, this means 154 people were quarantined. That's a lot because of this Delta variant. By the way, there's 81 students that got COVID. 16 teachers that got COVID. And 154 people are quarantined. I'm not just like... I'm not just like make, making you guys upset about COVID and stuff. Some reason I'm talking about this because I want you guys to learn that COVID is real and stuff like that. And it hasn't been gone. It was supposed to be gone like last month. But it wasn't because people aren't getting the vaccine. And stuff like that. By the way, I'm not trying to upset you guys, but I'm just letting you guys know about this because you know that that those students and teachers did not listen at all, or they just got COVID. So yeah, it's really heartbreaking and stuff like that. And you know that hopefully. We can do virtual soon. I don't know if that's going to happen or not. And stuff like that. I hope it happens because I get to spend time with my dad and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah. I got this information from my dad and he sent me the link and stuff like that. I won't go do it every day. I'm just going to let you guys know about this stuff because you know that people need to start listening and stuff like that. Um, yeah. And do you know New Orleans? Um, <coughs> there is a hurricane in New Orleans. There's a hurricane in New Orleans. 
good stuff. So yeah. Anyways. It's been a pretty good day today because I, we, yesterday we went to Indianapolis and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm not going to like keep talking about COVID and stuff like that. I'll probably do it like probably every day, but I'm not just going to like keep talking about that like almost every day because I don't want you guys to be upset and stuff like that. But I'll still be talking about it. But I'll still be talking about it, but just not all the time. So, yeah. And I hope you guys are safe and healthy during these hard times. So, yeah. I'm going to go now because I'm really tired. My parents are doing great. I'm at the house. I'm in my room. I'm not, I'm not at the kitchen that I'm usually in, but I might be in the kitchen soon. But, yeah. So anyways, I'm going to go and leave now. Hope you guys, you're safe and healthy. So yeah, subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Hit the bell and share and send me a comment if they're available. Um, I don't know what else to say really. So like, like I said, subscribe, hit the bell and share and send me a comment. And yeah, so yeah, um, yeah, I'm going to go now and stay safe and healthy, and yeah, bye everyone, I'll see you in my next video, bye!